hello welcome queens welcome back to my channel be great styles i'm the stylist keisha alexander and here i am doing a sleek down silk press um this is another technique that i learned in school and i actually forgot about it when i did my first video of silk pressing and this is so much better so you guys stay tuned this um i am blow drying down at a natural fall blow, blow drying at a natural fall, fall means the front hair is going forward the back hair is going back so the easiest way to do this part your hair in four sections as you can see that front hair that i'm blow drying right now is going towards the front and then the back i'm going towards the back and i'm still going in flipping my brush so i can get a good hold on it and so i can also get the hair at the bottom of the um underneath all the hair that's at the top and when you're blow drying make sure you blow dry all the way through like past the ends because sometimes you blow dry and you just let the brush grow and you're not really letting the um the hair at the ends get the same heat that you gave when you was going through the hair so just be mindful of that Again, another key point make sure you blow dry pass through the ends the only thing I used when I shampooed the hair and condition of course was smooth and sexy blowout cream so I use that it already has like a type of oil in it and it um, helps make the hair silk silky straight I guess You're silk down whatever smooth there you go smooth and sexy boom so it makes the hair smooth. the products that i use so if you get it like a, you have to get it at a professional store i like to use but aerosol if you get it the like whole system it works stuff, especially like, since the smooth accounts here already and has oil for my it. tongue tied so i don't want nothing too heavy on the hair if you okay i always apply the products while the hair is wet never after they're dry because you never want to put too much product it's on hot. the hair ever be blow dry so that's just, just my method and it works see, out. Y'all see how I'm flipping that wig back. Yes, yeah, so I'm the complete with the blow dry. It's all complete. As you can see, everything so falls down in direction. So you don't have to do sure much. Everything flat ironing. All one texture. Meaning the brush, it just pulls it more straighter. It goes through it more easier. And I'm going again through the ends. Just to make sure everything is straight. So I don't have to do a lot in my flat iron. And again, I'm going at a downward angle, but I'm putting a little bit more body in it, as you can see, and that's what a round brush does. So I'm not putting too much, but just a tiny bit. Now onto the flat iron, I'm starting in the back. I started the nape. The main part to a flat iron is doing one fourth partings. So that means your partings need to be small, so where it's not a whole bunch of hair in between, the top and the bottom of the hair you should be able to see through it
You guys ignore Jerome's beard. Man, I had this man mannequin since school, and it's the only one I could find to use with good hair. So, yeah, this this is the result of that. But here is me. This is the final results. Boom, boom, boom. You got movement. It's still got the shine to it. You don't have as much product, because guess what? We used it while the hair was wet. One for partings. The best you do in your blow dry is the less that you gotta do in your flat iron. So you guys just keep that in mind. And here's results to your perfect silk press. Just, just look at that movement. And of course, if you have African American hair, you can get your hair like this too. It's all about the texture of your hair, what state your hair is in, if you deep condition your hair how you do your hair, the foundation of it, it's, it's everything. So you guys just stay tuned. But this works for everyone's hair. If you use the same methods, one for partings, remember that you guys, it's, I cannot stress that enough, like your flat irons. I made that mistake so many times before I got into school. And also your round brush. The curlier your hair, use that round brush to pull it all straight and you won't have no problems. And here I am now just playing around with some curls, feather in the front, see what it look like. I really like the sleek look, but you know, some people want the feathers. So I'm just trying different curls. 
see what it do. But yeah, I like these girls. So yes, enjoy. I hope you guys learned something. Any comments, likes, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate it. See you guys later, queens. We'll